which is still early, Erin Levick, one of our graduate students, was interested in could you someday even help people with spinal cord injuries? So she worked originally with Ted Tang, who's at the VA, and uh, Evan Snyder, who's a stem cell expert, neuronal stem cell expert, who's now at the Burnham. And uh, what they did is they made a scaffold. Erin is a material scientist. She's now at Case as a professor <clears throat> to try to mimic the gray and white matter of the spinal cord. And um, she has an outer part that can help provide axonal guidance and an inner part, which is porous, where she'd put neuronal stem cells. Here's a, here's a picture of what it looks like. And what I'm going to show you are some of the animal studies that she and Ted did. Um, the first trials were a huge amount of work. Basically, what they did is 50 animals for 400 days. They followed them. Um, there were the, all of these. You'd put the implant in. We'd make the rats uh, paraplegic. You'd put the implant in, and uh, you'd follow it. And, and basically, the implants were put in in each case within 24 hours of the injury. So what I'm going to do is show you a mean from one of the control groups. There are three sets of controls, sham, uh, cells by themselves, or polymer by itself. And uh, I'll show you mean at 100 days of the control group. And what you see when you look at these animals, there are like 12 or 13 in each group, is uh, he's a, there's a scoring system, BBB scoring system. He has about a 5 out of 20. The way part of how you score is the paws are splayed in an awkward fashion. And these animals are not able to support their own weight. We'll just follow him for a little bit. But if you put the implant in, and particularly if you put the implant in with cells, they do better. And they, you can actually get up to a 14 on the mean, uh, which is the average of the treated group. And let me just show you that, also at 100 days. And it's not a cure by any means. They're still clumsy. But he's doing much better. He is able to support his weight. And he's kind of heavy. Notice the paws are also splayed more normally. And you can see him walking and so forth. Again, hardly a cure, but certainly an improvement. 